Oh man, yeah, you're gonna love these burgers. Ow! Ah! <laughs> Fuck you, passenger pegs. You're right there, Gimpy. I God. took mine off, bro. I know. I'm about to, but the kids will sometimes ride Look with at me. That. I mean, they were so fucking big and bulky. I mean, you, you lose all of this shit if you take it off. You just got to protect your rear brake. Yeah, I just, I like, I like putting my helmet on it. I bet you do. I can bend my knee now, which is good. It's just I hit, I hit my shin on the goddamn peg. Right. Oh, I love how this starts now. It hasn't been running this nicely in like six years. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm glad it's running again. I'm surprised the CBR guy didn't come up and say anything. Yeah. Identical bike as me. Well, this, do you see the way he rode in? He rides like a fucking douche. True. Most people on CBRs are douchebags anyway. Well, oh, yeah. Wait a minute. That was that was wrong. I didn't mean that. <laughs> All right. Back it on up, son. Am I gonna hit that cone? No. I don't know. Maybe. What's uh? I'm following you, man. Let's go up, burn it. We'll just ride for the hell of riding. Because we have motorcycles, we can ride. This fucking sweat in the beetle. Like, there's a car behind you. He couldn't fucking wait for us to move. I'm gonna go around this twat. <laughs> twat. Is Not it a make girl? Him fucking wait. Was that a dude in a beetle? Yeah. What the fuck is that? Oh my god. Woo. I forget how fast this thing is sometimes. Oh my god, I forget I had to change gear on this thing. Because <laughs> the rocket, I can just be in fifth gear right now and still have the acceleration. Oh, fucking hell. Fucking bus. Alright, go around him. Alright. We're good. That's how you get a ticket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've already got two that I have to take care of. I don't really want to get a third one. <laughs> Did you see uh, Jake's video about his walk nine wheels? Yeah. Like, Walk 9 missed the fucking opportunity there, didn't they? They should be like, here, have a brand new fucking set of wheels on us. Yeah, they must not, uh, they must not subscribe to him. Yeah, but they should. Oh my god, the marketing of opportunity there is insane. Yeah, I mean, it's got fucking quarter of a million fucking subscribers. Oh, I know. And you know he influences a lot of those on what to buy. Just by having it himself, whether he, uh, yeah, promotes it or not. Well, it kind of makes me nervous because those are the exact same wheels that are on my WR. Right. I think I have Excels on my DR. Yeah, I think you do. I think Excels are better. Oh, yeah? Oh, that's yeah. nice. That's what I, I mean, I didn't do much research because they came on the bike, obviously. Oh, yeah, same. I thought the Warp 9s were better. Uh, it's nice that all the uh, wildflowers are out. I, I mean, apparently Warp 9s have issues with bearings. Apparently so. But then, I mean, <laughs> look how many fucking wheelies he pulls. <laughs> True, <laughs> <laughs> but when you think about it, that, all that means is that the rotations were less on the front bearing. Uh, are we getting up here or are we staying we we're, exiting? We're gonna get off. Oh, okay. Uh, I got turn signals. Why am I using my hands? God yeah, I, I don't know, dude. I'm like, I know what you mean, but no other fucker on the road's gonna know what you mean. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I've been riding the WR a lot and I forget that I have turn signals. I hate that when someone's sitting at a, at a turn like that and they're not looking, they're turning right and they're looking right and they're yeah. going, they can't turn left or anything, it's like, what, why are, oh shit, watch out for this guy. <laughs> you know what also pisses me off is when I'm sitting at a junction and I'm waiting to pull out at an intersection. I'm sitting there waiting to make a left hand turn and there's cars coming and they make a right hand turn to where you're trying to come out from with no fucking signal. I'm like, yeah, I'm just sitting here like a muppet for fun. Like, if you'd have signaled, I could have fucking gone, you know? But no, yeah. I'm sitting here watching you come past, like... Thanks, uh, dude. It always reminds me of, uh... Your idol is acting weird. But it reminds me of that... There we go, it's better. Uh, yeah. Of that scene from, uh, Dark Knight. When they're watching the video of the Joker that he... He, he kidnapped that guy that looked like Batman. And, uh... 
it was a, it was. A, I think it's one of the better, better acting that was done in that movie. But it, it reminds me whenever I see someone looking the other way when I'm coming at him. I just go, look at me. Yeah. <laughs> oh shh, 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 shh. Sh. So you think Batman's made Gotham a better place? Yeah. Hmm? Can you look at me? Look at me. Heath Ledger is a genius. Or yeah. Was it? He was an amazing, amazing actor. That scene, it just. And he went from like, he was like giggling, laughing, laughing, and then it was just like serious. It was like the essence of the Joker of being right. giggly, yeah. giggly, and dangerous. It was just, oh, perfect. Oh, damn. Uh, I'm a bird. I can fly. <laughs> yeah, okay, so. I was going down to, uh, I was going down Mopac with um, my buddy Ross uh, and Dave and Tiener. Yeah. And uh, uh, Dave and Tiener were behind me, so it was Ross, then me, then Dave and Tiener. We're going down Mopac, going towards um, what's the Mount Bunnell. And uh, I, I remember before I left, my the, one of the bullets that holds my kickstand on was kind of loose. And it was a little stripped down in there, and I had just tightened it down, but it had like this washer. That thing like, running just way better. Oh, he did? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, yeah. yeah. Um, so oh, yeah. This, Do you say I had, yeah. remember you chatting about this, like the washer was it that went yeah, and found it its like, way into the fucking front sprocket on the Ducati? Yeah, so like the washer is like really, really thick, like giant, and it came off. And he's like, oh, oh, something hit me in the knee. And I looked down, my washer's gone. I'm like, oh, that was me. <laughs> and, uh, and then uh, we uh, we're, we're, we get off the freeway and he stops. He's like, whoa, something's weird. Like, my bike kind of lurched forward. Didn't feel like the clutch disengaged or something. And, like, his bike's making a weird sound and rattling and grinding and everything. We're like, whoa, what the fuck? So we uh, we go home. or we get him home, I don't think this lane turn. I don't know which one lane this does, but... We, he gets home and the next day, so I get a text with a picture of my washer, and he goes, "You brapping douchebag, is this your washer?" <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, and he's like, "It was stuck between my chain and my sprocket housing." Oh my god! <laughs> I'm like, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna need that back." <laughs> <laughs> and luckily, nothing actually broke on the Ducati. That's amazing. Maybe it improved it because things always break on Ducatis. Yeah, well, he brought it to the dealer, not knowing what was up, and, oh, then, right. and that's when they pulled that out. And he's like, I recognize that. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently we're going, oh yeah, we're going slow as fuck. <laughs> I think the speed limit's like 65 or something and we're doing 50. That's right. I wish we would get like credit for that, you know? It's like, oh, we've built up, you know, oh, we yeah. were doing 15 miles an hour below, so we get some credit. So when we get caught doing 15 miles over, it evens out. It's like, oh, it's right. So I built up some credit back there going slow. Yeah. So, you know, <laughs> I see you were going slow on accident a couple times. So we're going to go ahead and wave this one. Yeah. <laughs> I think that would be fucking great. Yeah. Oh, dude, I got pulled over the other day. Oh, yeah? In my driveway. <laughs> on what? A bike or? On the, on the CBR. Yeah. I was coming home, and apparently I rolled a stop sign. Oh, which, fuck that bullshit, man. I didn't believe. And, uh, we'll turn in here. And, uh, he pulled me over, but by the time he got his lights on and everything, I was... I was already in uh, in my driveway. Right. So I mean, I was on private property at this point. You know, he yeah. Can't, he can't give me a ticket. And he's like, "Oh, you ran that stop sign." I'm like, "I'm See, that's pretty." The... I'm like, "I'm pretty sure I didn't actually." Yeah. And he's like, "He's like, no, nope, you totally didn't stop." He's like, "He's like, I know you don't like downshifting and everything." I'm like, <laughs> "Like, dude, I come well, through." At least my... he's aware of that shit. Yeah. You know? like, I come through here on first. I'm like, but you know, I'm not gonna argue with you. If you said I rolled it, then you know what? All right. I probably did it on accident. I was looking at this guy, you know, all that stuff. There was another guy coming around the same time, and I'm like, I didn't want him to hit me. And he's like, yeah, we have problems with people running that stop sign. I'm like, yeah, I know we do. Trust me. I, I've seen people do it all the time. I'm well aware you're totally in the right for sitting there watching. And uh, I'm like, I pointed to my helmet, and I'm like, well, you know, I'll check the GoPro, make sure I did, you know, just to learn from that. Right after you saw that, he's like, all right, well, I'm just going to give you a warning. It's like, yeah, no shit. And once you see the GoPros on. Ah!